Hey, my name is Phil and welcome to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna be reviewing a video tool called SendSpark. And in the SendSpark review, I'm gonna be sharing exactly what SendSpark is, how it works, and who this tool is perfect for. Now, just in case you've missed it, they are currently hosting a lifetime deal right now. So if you wanna get SendSpark at a one-time price, make sure you check out the link in the description to get all of the info. So first of all, what is SendSpark? Well, SendSpark is a video recording tool that actually works from your Chrome browser, which allows you to create quick, short and sharp video messages that you can send to people around the internet. And the reason this is such a powerful feature is because the internet is full of information and media right now. So if you can personalize something that's visual and send it to either a prospect, a client or a, a customer, then there's a very good chance this person is going to remember you and stick around. So that's why this tool really stood out for me. It's one of these little game changing things that's helping people get more conversions in 2021. So I'm really excited to be sharing this with you. So what I'm going to do right now is actually jump behind the screen, show you some features of SendSpark and how it works. Okay, so here we are behind the screen. Uh, first of all, we're going to start on the SendSpark website. I just want to show you the different pricing options they have. Now there are three different levels you can get. It is the free, the pro and the enterprise. On the free, you can get three videos for free and you just have to use the SendSpark branding. Um, however, if you go on the pro plan, which I highly recommend, you get unlimited videos. You can add your own logos. You can also download videos and add video calls to action which I'll show you all about in a second now if you're watching this video you might notice that there is actually a lifetime deal going for SendSpark right now and this is the pricing that you can expect to see if you want to get the first tier license for $39 you can actually get 150 total videos and you can also get one workspace with three users and 20 gig however I always recommend getting the unlimited one which is tier 2 for $99 you can have up to five workspaces which I'll go through in a second as well as unlimited total videos including recordings and requests as well as 100 gigabytes storage so there's a lot of options you can actually choose from I'd highly recommend going for the tier 2 as you can get unlimited limited total videos so this license will last you a very very long time so what I've done is I've actually gone ahead and logged in. Now when you first get started with SendSpark, it's going to ask you to add in the Chrome extension, which is this one here. I've already got it actually added on my dashboard as you can see here. And as you can see, I now have a little panel at the bottom as well as my face on the screen on the bottom left. This is actually on the both uh, screen and face mode, perfect for doing tutorials, instructional videos, anything like that, especially if someone's stuck with something, you can walk them through nice and easily. However, most of the time, if you're sending a video message, you'll want to use the face option, which is going to create just a little light box where you can actually record from. Now this video feed is recorded from my MacBook Pro depending on your different type of computer you're using it may look a little bit different but once you're actually ready to start recording a video all you need to do is click on the record button and as you can see the video is recording I could say something like hey John it's nice to meet you thanks for inquiring about my services in my digital marketing agency just letting you know I'm really happy to help you out um, I'll leave some information below we can get in touch and if I did a little voice message like that for John, who's interested, for example, in my digital marketing agency, he would be very excited to see that I spent some time to actually create a little voice message for him, a little video message. So now it is actually rendered. It is going to redirect me to my SendSpark dashboard where my video is going to be. As you can see, I've already got my custom branding on here. And you can see there's a little GIF of the um, the video that I've created. Now, this is where we can actually start personalizing the message. So what's going to happen is once you've actually finished, you're going to get a link um, for this entire page. So I could write, um, hey, John, nice to meet you. Say this video is for a person named John. I could write a little message below it and I could say, let's um, connect. Love to have, oh, let's connect for coffee. Right, and then I could have a call to action, which is a button, and this could be uh, choose a time in my calendar, right? And then I could put in the URL here, which could be, you know, whatever your Calendly link is or whatever service you use. 
and then um, that's all looking pretty good basically it's going to send him that but what we can do to make this even better something even better than this is actually go to the edit thumbnail section and inside of here you can actually add text over your little caption your giphy that's going there right so let's just say hey john i shot this quickly for you and then I could go ahead and click save changes. You can also look for your logo inside of here as well. Um, or you can fast forward it to a part of the video that you want to sort of loop. But I'm just going to leave it at the beginning. Click on save changes. And now if you look at this, it's actually going to show up here, right? How cool is this? If John was to receive this email or message from me and he saw that I shot him a quick video, do you think he's going to take notice of who I am and what my services are or who I am as a person or as a trainer or whatever the situation is that you'd actually use this tool? This is so super powerful. Of course, they're going to go click on it. They're going to watch the video and then they also have here the option to actually book a time. So that's why I love it. Once you're happy with it, you can actually preview the share page, which is basically where they're going to be redirected as you can see i'll just turn off the sound um, this is the video looks pretty good everyone's happy there's even a little thumbs up button and just to let you know once people actually open this particular video they're going to get um, tracked as well you'll see the engagement from it but basically here it is there's the button everything's good if they're happy that's amazing so you can see this is a very powerful tool let's just say it is all done i'm ready to share the video what you can then do is actually come up to the top click on share video we're going to have a few options here things like download the thumbnail which is that um the sort of animated gif here or you can download the entire video you can also copy the preview or have the share link but the magic really happens when you use the embed video feature this is perfect for actually putting it inside of your emails or on your website anything like that so basically if you sent them an email with this email code inside of it it's going to play the gif inside of the email people are going to click on it it's going to take them to the page and they're going to be able to see the video so it's a very very powerful tool so now i'm done with this i can go ahead click done and that video is added to my library just like that and then as people start going through it you can see how many people visit it how many people actually play it how many people click on the link and how many people actually like the video and to be honest what this video took me less than a minute to create and if you have a spare minute to engage with your audience your customers your clients your leads um, anything like that you're going to see more results that's for sure now a few other features while we are here there is also the team videos this is where you can invite members onto your workspace where you can actually um, all collaborate together which is really cool you also have here templates which is basically some different types of templates that people can actually create these are the founders of SendSpark. they've got some really good information here but another very very cool tool is the request video tool right the, re uh, the video request basically what this will do is if you have a course if you have a program if you have a service anything like that where you would love to have video testimonials from people this tool is exactly what you need you can just go ahead and click on this request video button and what it's going to do is create a quick link for you and if i went and visited this link right now this is what people will see so basically if they click start recording now anyone who gets this particular link can actually start recording right from their computer or their phone and they can upload it directly to your SendSpark account or they can upload a video themselves and it will end up in your gallery. So it's very, very powerful, especially if you have an online business and you want to start getting some testimonials. I highly, highly, highly recommend using this feature. Now, just to continue on, there are a few other things you can do inside of SendSpark. For example, if you have more than one brand, you can actually create what's called workspaces. So for example, I have here my personal one. I've also got my marketing channel as well as I've got another blog that I'm using, another brand. You can choose different brands inside of here and add uh, different users in each brand and keep videos completely separate, which I think is amazing. And if you want to customize your brands inside of it too, you just come to manage workspace where you can edit the particular brand that you're working with you're going to be allowed to change things like the logo as well as the name and the global styles and if you want to change your own personal um, account details you also can do in here as well where you can upload things like your logo um, your job title everything like that and that's pretty much it that is SendSpark in a nutshell I personally believe this is a great tool what I'm actually going to do right now is jump behind the camera one more time I want to talk to you about the different types of use cases for this tool
Okay, so that was SenseBark. As you can see, it is such an easy tool, but man, does it pack a punch. These little video messages are definitely going to increase your brands and businesses engagement and no doubt help promote customer sales. So if you are interested in increasing your brand awareness, increasing your relationships with your customers and your people within your business, then I highly recommend checking out SenseBark. I know personally, I'm gonna start using this tool each and every day as it only takes a few minutes, but gives you such a big reward. Okay, that's it from me guys. I hope you've enjoyed this SenseSpark review. If you have, make sure you hit the thumbs up button and subscribe for more videos. And if you want to get the lifetime license, there is more information in the description. Go ahead and check that out. Okay guys, that's it from me. I'll see you on the next video.